Hey y'all, welcome to another episode of Talking Greenwood with Mayor B. I'm here at uh, a place that is a destination for us. It's a Thanksgiving tradition that we we often uh, we often come here with our family, uh, but other times as well. It's a unique attraction to the Greenwood area. Now technically, we are outside the city limits. My friends Tommy and Carolyn McCutcheon run the uh, the 25 auto drive-in here in Greenwood. It is one of the few across the state, and it is run with a labor of love by the McCutcheons. It's a throwback to the days when people used to go to drive-ins all the time, but they got a great thing going here. They got three screens, and draw, we draw people from all over. So even though they're technically outside the city limits, it has a a great impact on the city of Greenwood. We really love coming here. We got we got family from out of town for Thanksgiving. They're gonna come. We're gonna watch Ghostbusters tonight. Uh, I probably will have my phone on watching the Clemson Carolina game as well. <laughs> yes, but um, but it's it's fun for the whole family. It's a little. It's getting a little chilly tonight. Trying to bundle up, but so we may do a, a combo of inside and outside. But, uh, but anyway, we'll show you around a little bit inside as well. We're in here in the concession stand where all the great food is made. And here with the family, everybody say hey. You got the Smith boys, the sister-in-law, Christine, cousins, Uncle Bill, uh, here's Wink and Cole. Anyway, we're, uh, we're watching, they got the game on, they got the Iron Bowl on. Yeah. Big upset here. So you can you can check both out. Um, but some really good food. What, what you got there? Uh, uh, mozzarella sticks. Mozzarella sticks. Mm. Yeah, they um, they got a great. They, they know what they're doing. It's from the McCutcheon uh, restaurant dynasty, of course. So. Well, look at that. <laughs> yeah. All right, here with Carolyn McCutcheon. Carolyn, how are you? I'm doing fine. Thank you for coming over tonight. Welcome to the drive-in. Well, thank you for having us. This is, <laughs> as I was just explaining, this a Thanksgiving tradition for our family. We love to come here and, and we've been coming here for years. Tell us, how long have y'all been open now? We reopened the drive-in in 2009. Opened up in April. It's been really, really enjoyed. It's been so many people here, right. and so many people come in just for the holidays, year right. after year after year. Right. Yeah, I mean, it's one of just a few around, so people are coming from all over the place. Am I right? Oh, they came from Denmark, England. They come from all over the world. Wow. Wow. Uh, well, I know it's a labor of love for y'all. They put in work in this place, and it, that's why it just has such a great feel. Um, they got, you got three, uh, three screens now. Yeah, we have three movie screens. And yeah. Each one has a double feature on it every Friday and Saturday night. Right. So two movies, guaranteed. And so you can listen in your car and you can get one of these things over here with these radios, right? Uh, yeah, these are the Ryobi radios. Uh -huh. They last for about 18 hours. So you get the full movie experience. What do you recommend? Do you, the radios? Some people would... You might want to get a car battery to die, so you, would you recommend one of those? Well, this is what I use when I watch the movies. Right. Then if you sit outside, then you have clear sound or inside. Right, right. Well, you know, y'all, I think especially over the last year, had to get creative with certain things, so this was always a, a uh, place where you could come, fresh air, and even during the pandemic, yeah, yeah, even during the uh, pandemic, the governor never shut his fan. We were open every weekend. Right. That's great. It's because it's such a great place for families to come. Sure. So if the if the show starts at seven thirty, what time should folks get here? Can you On a Saturday night I get here at six thirty when the gates open. Right. What you have to realize is it's the drive in, it's a whole evening of entertainment. Right. People come here and get something to eat. They play outside. Kids have a good time. Got a kids play. Have a playground out there. Yeah. Plenty of dining. Have patio dining out uh, here. People just come and have fellowship, congregate. Right. Yeah. Tiki shirts too. Oh, we got our T-shirts. Yes. Yeah. We can. Well, Carolyn, thank you for hey, let me show you this one. We just came up with this one. Right. 
We put the year on it and everything. All right. That's 2022. That's getting ahead. <laughs> yeah, that's getting ahead. We just got a bit. Those are, those are, those are good stocking stuffers. Absolutely. Yeah. They are. And we did gear certificates. That's great. Yeah. That's good. They got movie posters all over the place. Uh, they try to keep them updated as well, I can tell. So. Yeah, we just do the new releases. We get the same ones the indoor theaters get, same okay. day. So, come check it out. This is uh, just a really cool place to come. We we love having them here. Come check out the auto drive-in, you know, 25. Yeah, come, come join us at the drive-in. Our website is 25drivein.com. Come here. back in the kitchen. Put the cheeseburgers all different sorts of ways. <laughs> Wanna, I'd like to thank D.W. Boone's for sponsoring the, the video. Y'all check out D.W. Boone's, check out the drive-in. Thank you. Thanks so much. Y'all have a wonderful evening. Thank y'all. You too.